Hey guys, I'm Nick, aka the one of Nick's Games. Today I'm teaching you guys how you can add commands to your Twitch.tv live stream using Nightbots. Let's go ahead and jump on into this. First off, you want to go to Nightbot.tv or the first link in the description down below. Go down there, click that, it'll take you here where you want to click on login in the top right. Now, it's going to take us off to Twitch and we're going to have to uh, authorize our Twitch account. Or in my case, it automatically logged me in. But there we go. If we hit log in, it'll take us off and we'll have to authorize the Twitch account. But it keeps doing it. Why? Because I'm already logged in on Twitch. So to do that, I'd have to go log in on Twitch and come back and then I'll, it would work. But nevertheless, log in the, you know, account by using Twitch. Pretty simple stuff. Once you've done that, though, we need to uh, go ahead and set up Moobot, which is pretty simple to do. All you've got to do is click on Join over here, right? Simple as that. Now, you need to go to your Twitch chat. For me, that's going to be twitch.tv slash nixgames. Links down below if you want to come watch me stream every single day on Twitch TV at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But you want to come over here to uh, to Twitch, and as you can see, there's Nightbot joining. Now we're going to mod Nightbot. To do that, you need to do slash M-O-D and then Nightbot. Simple as that. And it will now add mod Nightbot as a moderator of the chat room. Then we need to come back over here and to add commands, it's pretty simple. You need to click on custom commands here or custom commands over here, whichever one you want to is fine. Type, go custom commands and then type in what command you want. So for example, if we wanted to do exclamation point tutorial, right? We can do that and, oh, that's disabled commands. Where's it at? Add a new command. And then we want to do exclamation point tutorial and we can go, this is the tutorial command. Now, if I wanted to make everyone be able to run this, meaning no matter who joins my channel, they can run this command, I would do everyone. If I wanted to be a regular, meaning someone who I've added as a regular to my channel, then I can do that. Subscribers, someone who subscribes to my channel, if you're partner and have subscribers, you can do that. Moderator only or owner of the channel, which is just you. Only the broadcaster can run this command. I would recommend probably doing regular everyone if you have a smaller Twitch channel. If you have a bigger Twitch channel, I would probably do subscriber, and that means moderators, owners, and subscribers can run it. But for right now, I think everyone is going to be fine, and uh, add new command. So there you have that. Now we can just come over here, do exclamation point, tut, Oriel, right like that, and wait for it. Come on now, don't do this to me. There it was. You see it? This is the tutorial command. Simple as that. Now, it gets really confusing when you're like me and have two bots in your stream, so we could do this right now, or we could do exclamation point TP for texture pack, right? Nick is not using a texture pack, right? We'll just do that because I'm not right now. I'm not even live. So we can add a new command, come back over here, and then we can do exclamation point TP. Now watch what happens. Moobot responds and Nightbot responds. So back to back, we have Moobot responding and then Nightbot responding. So it's, it's a little confusing whenever you have two bots in your chat, and that's why I would recommend not having two bots in your chat. As a matter of fact, I'm actually going to remove Moob Nightbot from my chat as soon as I get done with this tutorial because I use Moobot. And I've actually got a video coming up next week on which one you should use. Which one's better, Moobot or Nightbot? So look out for that. But yep, yeah, there you go. You now added commands to your Twitch TV live stream using Nightbot. I believe you can have like up to uh, 25 free commands with Nightbot. I believe that's it. And then you have to start paying. Um, which is actually, I think, the same as Moobot now. I think Moobot also gives you 25 free. They didn't used to, but now they do. And, uh, we can go into spam protection here. There's tons of different stuff you can do with, uh, with Moobot, but, or Nightbot, but I'm not gonna go through it all. And, uh, I will tell you guys which one I like better. You can probably guess by the one I use in my chat. And why I like it better, which is the most important thing, next week when I compare both Nightbot and Moobot and, uh, help you decide which bot you should use. Or, uh, on Twitch TV. So, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Let's go ahead and part and move out from the channel. And, uh, yeah, I will see you guys later. I'm Nick's Games. Thanks for watching. And I'm out. Peace. Subscribe to the channel. Give it a thumbs up if you haven't already. And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. Down that way, we've got how to set up Moobot. You've now seen how to add commands with, uh, with Nightbot. What about Moobot? Go check out that video to see me set up Moobot from start to finish. It's pretty incredible. Go check it out. And down the other way, we've got how to install Optifine in Minecraft 1.8.7. That shows you exactly, well, how to install Optifine in Minecraft 1.8.7. Go check it out. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out, guys. Peace.